gotten so foggy. Can't even see the water anymore. Just finished up some calls. I also popped this pesky pimple that has been on my face all day. I also put on a pimple patch last night and just realized I still had it on. Okay, makeup is done. This is the look. Select clean. I'm gonna wash my hair later today. I also brought with me my Skims dress, which thank God I did because tonight's attire is cocktail, which I didn't even know. Okay, this is the outfit. I have a little bit of the bodysuit shaper kind of showing through, but I'm actually not mad at the straps. And then this dress is pretty long and I didn't bring heels, so I just threw on my little New Balances. And we're off to dinner. This is Brandon's outfit. Here, it's kind of backlit. Got some French workwear. Black pants and new loafers from Doc Martens. Finally made it out, walking around the city. It's nice because our hotel is pretty close to everything. We're staying at the Fairmont, which actually when Brent and I were here three years ago, we walked in and looked at some of the Christmas decorations and stuff like that while we're here. So it's funny to now be staying there, but we're off to get some dumplings, had some coffee because we woke up at like 11. 12 hours of sleep it was real good.
good morning. Last night we had an amazing sushi dinner. We'll tell you more about it later. We wanted to come home and do a clothing haul, but we were just so exhausted. So today we'll share some of the things that we picked up yesterday. This was um, a thrift haul from a store called, what was the store called? Chameleon Vintage. It was in like little Japan town in their little shopping mall and we picked up so many items for such a good price. I got this like kind of leather bomber Lennerman's looking jacket and it's just super plain. All it says is that and then on the back it's completely plain so I thought it would be really fun for Brian and I put some patches on it, kind of make it our own and this was only $85 which for like a thick coat is great. Okay and then I got this like vape button up. It's this yellowish color but I thought it was kind of fun the little um, logo super small great for layering this was $65 this like random little sweater that I thought would be so fun for Christmas Brandon wore it yesterday to celebrate Lunar New Year just super cute like chunky knit sweater I think this was like $30 which is great then just this little LL Bean sweater this is just a good classic I feel like my sister would also love this and then Brandon got a cute little Thermal. It's actually really long and he layered with it yesterday, which looked really cool. So it's kind of like a good different piece. Vintage Rolling Stones tea. Super washed out and just a cool little tea. And then we went to the store called Cotton Sheep, which is really, really cool. And I got this Made in Japan button up. It's from a brand called Capital and the fit was just really cool. I love a good white button up and it's got some detailing on here that kind of makes it really unique. Show them your pants you got. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Some capital. Pants. Super cool. Very different, and I yeah. like that those don't look like thrifted or anything, so that'll be something that we can share. And then we went to the store called Modern Apparel Clothing, mm -hmm. right? Something. Yeah. It's called Short and Mac. But they have a lot of like Japanese designers, other designers, and they have this incredible sale. So everything we picked up was on sale. Got these cute little, what are these called? Like mocks? Clogs? Slippers. Slippers. I love them. And it's just kind of like this wool material. I wanted them in gray, but they didn't have my size. But those will still be cute. And then I got this sweater from Junior Watanabe, which was on crazy sale. And this is just a really chunky knit that both Brandon and I can wear. It's very different than what I have in my collection. And I outfitted it kind of cropped yesterday. So I feel like this would just be kind of a cool piece. Pretty heavy too. So great for when it's colder. Um, Brandon was shopping for me while I was trying my stuff on. And turns out I just bought everything that he got me. My stylist. Yep. Yeah. Then I got these like really cool pleated oversized pants, size large. They just look really cool, very Japanese-esque. So, really good haul.
Hello friends, finishing up this vlog while we are chilling in our hotel lobby, but we are headed back home to LA. Had a great time in San Francisco. We spent all day today pretty much walking around and the city is pretty compact, but a lot of the different neighborhoods that we wanted to explore was over a mile from each other. So we did a lot of walking around. We went to the um, Japan mall area, which is really cute. We went there yesterday as well. And we went back to the sushi restaurant that Brit and I went to like three years ago when we were last here. And it was good. Don't pay a lot of money and the quality kind of reflects that. And it was hard because we went to such an amazing restaurant last night. So it's hard to compare to that, but good little snack. And then we did some thrifting and vintage shopping in High Ashbury, which is kind of like a fun area. Kind of reminds me of like Fairfax in LA. Brandon was kind of likening it to Brooklyn in New York. So yeah, it was a fun little exploration day. We are so tired. We stared at the Fairmont while we were here and we actually quite enjoyed this hotel. The rooms were a little bit dated, but I think you really pay for like the grandness of the lobby and a lot of the amenities that they had. So fun little 24, uh, how long were we here? 48 hours, 36? Yeah, so 48 hours. Yeah, so it's a fun little 48 hours. We're gonna go back to the airport and chill in the lounge for a while before our flight. We have a late night flight back into LA, but it was a good time. I'm really happy with a lot of the things that we thrifted and picked up. I hope you guys enjoy the vlog and we did go to Whistler right before this. So if you missed that vlog, I'll link it up in the corner, but I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.